Not this time of the year. The leaves are turning, there's a bracing chill in the air. Plus, there's a whole new crop of female grad students about to put on just enough winter weight to make them needy and vulnerable. <laughs> That's right, honey, have another calzone. Daddy can wait. <laughs> Isn't that university policy against dating graduate students? No, if you can talk to them, you can ask them out. Damn, there's always a catch. Hey, guys. Hey, Leslie. So, dumbass, I heard you made a grad student throw up last night. The truth can indeed be a finger down the throat of those unprepared to hear it. But why should I cater to second-rate minds? Because first-rate minds call you dumbass? Oh, yeah? Well, you're a mean person. Excuse me, Dr. Cooper. I'm Ramona Nowitzki. I was at your talk last night. I think you're just brilliant. That is the prevailing opinion. God, now I'm gonna throw up. Howard Wallowitz, Department of Engineering, co-designer of the International Space Station's liquid waste disposal system. Ew. Dr. Cooper, I've read everything you've published. I especially liked your paper on grand unification using string network condensates and was wondering how you determined that three-dimensional string nets provided a unified picture of fermions and gauge bosons. Amazing. An intelligent labradoodle. Woof. <laughs> the fact is, I'm quite close to a breakthrough in showing how neutrinos emerge from a string net condensate. Oh, my God. That would change the way we view the entire physical universe. It's what I do. <laughs> You know, the Pishkin Wallowitz liquid waste disposal system is turning a few heads as well. Again, ew. <laughs> you know, I'd love to hear more about how you intend to add neutrinos. Could we get a cup of coffee sometime? I don't drink coffee. I do. I love me a cup of joe. <laughs> well, it doesn't have to be coffee. How about dinner? I do eat dinner. Great. I know a terrific little Italian place. I never eat in strange restaurants. One runs the risk of non-standard cutlery. Excuse me? Sheldon lives in fear of the three-tined fork. Three tines is not a fork. Three tines is a trident. Forks are for eating. Tridents are for ruling the seven seas. What if I brought food to your place? That would be acceptable. On Mondays, I eat Thai food. Meat crab and chicken satay with extra peanut sauce from Siam Palace. You got it. I already have your address. What a nice girl. <laughs> Sheldon, do you have any idea what just happened? Yes. Apparently, I'm getting a free dinner. 